Hello friends, welcome back to Galactic Starfighter. So this is now my second match in about six months, so again, forgive me if I'm a little bit rusty. But we will do our best, once again, a death match, so I'm going to try not to die. Try to lend some damage to the team, different map this time though. Alright, so I see one of my allies there with a very long name. Two of them, that's always good, and we have another person joining us. Hopefully we have at least as many players as the opposing team now. And somebody on our team has a damage overcharge, which is good news for sure. Oh, and somebody self-destructed, which is bad news for sure. Alright, looks like all the bad guys are kind of far away. I wonder if there's... Oh, that guy's not. That didn't get the lock in time, though. Somebody's firing at me, though, so let's try to just break that. Um... I totally forgot what I was going to say there. I want, oh, I wish there was a way that it would show like the distance of every player on your screen and not just the one you have like targeted over. Because it's always like a matter of like browsing them. Which I guess is kind of fun too, like you're hunting to see who's nearby. All right, we do have to get into combat at some point. And we're starting to get elite, which is good. It makes me feel better about being a little more adventurous here. Oh, and there's something. Because even if we... Um, Weapon overcharge, nice. Um, even if we end up dying, we're still going to be in the lead by quite a bit. So, all right, let's find some enemies. There's a few, and I'm going to start with the, uh, the missiles. They're all pretty far away, but that guy's not. Okay, let's do an about face. Let's change this guy's a little bit closer. Hey, we got a hit. Yes, a direct hit. He's out of range of my missiles. We can swap to protons, maybe in a second. Okay, he's not coming out, but this guy is. Fire. Ah, I was really hoping to get that missile off and then to uh, hit my evasive ability and my shield reboost, but. Got a little too cocky there. And we are way pushing them to their side of the map, back to their spawn point. So let's go full speed mode. Let's see if I can get back in the action. Yeah, I wonder if I'm like with a pre-made that maybe I was against last time, because it's like night and day. I like to keep some fuel in the tank for uh, for flying away if I'm in trouble. And I believe our evasive ability does require it as well. Everybody's kind of far away right now. Maybe I'll go after this guy. Triple. Strike again. Got them. Hey, got him. That wasn't too bad. We got that off just in time. A little bit of damage on our shields, but not much. Oh, okay, they are still on our butt. Let's go through here. Ah, uh, crap. I think I have a debuff on. I do have debuffs. Yeah, it's hard to fly. But not impossible. All right, here's some allies. I am almost out of fuel, though, so hopefully I've broken my, my tail. Rocks, which is smart. Rocks are your friend. Well, unless you crash into them. Try to do these tight turns. Hey, there we go. Alright, just by having like one engine on fire. Uh, we're actually doing something helpful here, which feels good. Let's watch for this guy now. Okay. I was hoping I could destroy him before he destroyed me. I always take those risks and then regret it. I guess not always, because clearly I didn't there. But it would be nice to uh, get some health back. Alright, we're getting some fuel back at least. I 
see somebody hiding behind that rock there, kind of on his own. I think he might be a good target. Unless somebody gets to him first. Where is he? There he is. That luck. Let's try the short range missiles. No, oh, he's a little too far away for that. Oh, he's behind the rock now. Well, 49 points. This is almost over. Try to get some hits off, but nope, not quite. All right, well, let's see. I probably still didn't do a lot of damage, but okay, actually, you know what? I will take that right in the middle of the pack, give or take. Yeah, you can tell, <laughs> these must be like, I'm guessing a pre-made, I could be totally wrong, but definitely the pros. I think Sleeper was the only really experienced player on their team, maybe, maybe these guys a little bit, but. All right, and Deaths was not that bad, so hey, I'm, I'm proud of myself. Got more kills than I died, and that's what matters in a death match, so. All right, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. I'll be doing a few more of these tonight as long as the cues keep popping, so stay tuned for more.